welcome to this edition of Wednesday Web Chat. This is Carl Lewis, your host, and today we're going to be taking a look at pervasive analytics and creating a simple little KPI of our own, but rather than using one of the many out-of-the-box KPIs that are delivered with the SAP Business One solution powered by HANA. So uh, let's jump over into our SAP Business One system now and um, see if I can uh, help show you how to create uh, a KPI. So um, basically, um, these many of the things on my screen here today, now in order to really take advantage of the KPIs, you have to use the uh, Fiori interface for SAP HANA, right? And so that's here. And um, I can move this out of the way a little bit for, for myself. And I'll scroll down here a little bit so that you can see I've got some others. So here's, uh, I've kind of pre-created uh, these KPIs that I want to talk about today and give you an example of how these were created. Uh, this is a count of sales orders without deposits. And here's a count of sales orders with deposits. And here's the total number of sales orders, right? So I created all three of those. We're going to take a look at how I did that. And uh, so that you can get a, a, a good good idea, it's not hard to create these, and you can come up with various ideas about KPIs, right? Key performance indicators uh, that you want to track in your own company and and, uh, and watch. So to do it, uh, we go to tools, and then to pervasive analytics. Now we've uh, in previous sessions we sort of did you know how you navigate this, how you pick things, put them on the screen rearrange them, for instance, and stuff like that. But here we see uh, this pervasive analytics designer screen right now. So we have KPIs, dashboards, and advanced dashboards. Now, over the next uh, couple of Wednesday web chats, we're going to get into dashboards, and then a couple weeks later, we'll look at advanced dashboards. Uh, but today, we're going to look at KPIs. So normally, what you would do is to create a new one, you would click on the new KPI button, and this screen would come up. So we could go through 